And if I was you, I wouldn't attack, to be honest, because this could be Mirror Force. You going through with it? Oh, 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 oh. I activate Mirror Force! Now I get to summon Obelisk Tormentor and attack you for... What do you mean it's not my turn? Bro, this is exactly how the car works. It's Obelisk! Hold on, my phone's ringing. You stay right there. Hello? Oh, nothing. I'm just doing the homie. Uh, they're trying to tell me that I can't summon my Obelisk when it's their turn, but... Yeah. Wait, new mode. Macedon? What, what do we have to do? Everything's banned? Then what do you play? That's allowed? Ooh, I have the perfect idea. I, I got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah, no, no, no. It's fine. Uh, uh, I need you to come over to my house and finish this duel for me. I have work to do. Bet. Uh, I mean, you, the obvious is on the field, so you can win. Cool, cool, cool. Just make sure you lie because you actually can't do the play that I did. But it's it's Yu-Gi-Oh! And there's no judge around, so it's fine. Yeah. Cool, cool. All right, bet, 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 bet. A lot of times when I sit down to record these intros, I have no idea where I'm going with them. And even after recording that, I still have no idea where that conversation or that interaction was supposed to go. It was meant to be a bit random. But I hope you guys enjoyed that. So, yeah. Even my editor is sitting there like, All right, we have a brand new mode in Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel featuring the theme Chronicle. I have no idea what is supposed to be played in this like literally i went through so many cards everything is banned dark magician for example has eternal soul and dark magic circle ban blue eyes has alternative ban for no reason and jet like what are you supposed to play but they allow cards like maxi ash blossom hand traps are allowed forbidden droplet so uh, cards are still allowed but like i don't understand what the point is regardless you know what is allowed the alistair engine which is kind of surprising because i've been playing that a lot for the past two weeks has given birth this deck right here. The idea, honestly, is to summon Obelisk and honestly strike the fear of God into my opponent to make them leave. That, that's really it. I don't know what else I'm supposed to do with this, to be honest. Uh, by the way, I have Rite of Armis here in here, along with Water Enchantress, but uh, Griffin Rider's banned, so we don't get the negate. But the idea, honestly, is just to get bodies on board. I want to get bodies on board and summon my invoke cards to stop my opponent. And in theory, that should work, but it's always in theory. Hey, end of the day, it's an event. It doesn't matter if you want to lose. It's just supposed to be fun. You're supposed to think differently when you make your decks, and uh, that's just how it is. I mean, I have people still play those crazy metas that they figured out over the course of the past day of this being live. For whatever reason, you figure out how to be broken in this mode. But most de most duels should be fine, in theory. All right, let's see what we can do in the first duel. Lost a coin toss, which is kind of bad, but we got Max C. Again, I don't know why this is legal in here out of everything. Are you playing Sky Strikers? Are Sky Strikers allowed? Due to the nature of this event, a lot of, uh, ooh. Sure. Due to the nature of this event. Oh, Thunder Dragons are allowed? Wait, no, they're not. No, they're not, because Thunder Dragon is, um, Thunder Dragon Colossus is banned. So is Titan allowed? Please let that resolve. Oh, it resolved. Due to the nature of this event, a lot of, like, okay decks are just absolutely snapped here. Despite having them kind of missing important cards, like Thunder Dragon Colossus missing here. But even then, Titan will be annoying here. Maybe I can draw do a lure of darkness again, bro. I always, I always said this, but I feel like a lure of darkness is insane as a card because it, when it was first made, it wasn't meant to reward you for banishing cards. But there's certain cards that benefit off of being banished. I, I think a lure of darkness is ready to go down to one. They're turning in there or nothing. Never mind. <laughs> I mean, again, this is the, the the nature of this mode. I mean, this is what happens. But this one card could be everything here. And it could also have um, Max C. Soul Energy Max. Not bad. And they're gone. So what I was about to do, I was going to sell a Magical Meltdown, going to Alice, or going to uh, Nemesis Corridor, going to another body, and get uh, uh, Abbas out. But we're not, we're not going to do that. But we'll do that next duel. You understand, I am hungry right now. It is 4 o'clock. I have not eaten yet. This hand is dead. This hand is... Uh, dead upstar goblin has to get me there <laughs> magical meltdown alistair question mark this hand this upstar goblin got me here i summon alistair the invoker oh this is gonna be actually kind of a nasty little combo i was gonna say if they had imperm it'll be, it'll be ggs so we're gonna go ahead and do this go into artemis and i get to summon one of my favorite cards of all time period solid magician i'm gonna go ahead and tribute uh there you go attack mode Boom. And now we do Invocation, and we get to summon Mechaba. Because we have both of these. We get rid of you, get rid of you. There you go. In attack mode. And honestly, I'm not going to set anything here. I'm going to just add all of these, because this is a negate based on what card you have in your hand. And honestly, I want Soul Energy Max in the graveyard. Forbidden Drop it would be useful, but I'd rather be in my hand. 
we're just gonna pass okay so we get one regular negate and we get one spell negate does it get me there i mean in this mode every play matters so let's see what we can play through uh dark lords i'm gonna ash that one i'm gonna ash that one stop that one right now and then when, when the time comes i can hit him with one of these obviously i'll, I'll save the solid magician uh one first yeah that's not happening that is not happening we're gonna go ahead and negate that one no drop alistair and now whatever spell they have potentially in the hand has to get me there does this have an effect sent to the graveyard they have more yo <gasps> oh no oh no 2600 attack oh that's pretty powerful um i gonna put that back send one dark lord from hand or face up field destroy all card in the field no not myself magician i should you know what i'm i'm sw i'm swapping the second copy out i'm officially going to swap the second copy out my life points damn so it didn't get me there but if i had level eight which i <laughs> regret not having a draw i'll be fine Ooh, that sucks i'm just going to set this and set that okay i'm still alive that card that it just drew surely won't be you know the demise of me night shape trick stars bro trick stars oh that's going to get uh negated actually it's gonna be beautiful because what i'm gonna do i'm gonna activate call by the grave first on that boom and then i'm gonna do forbidden droplet forbidden droplet and i'm going to send you and you to the graveyard to stop both of these from doing whatever they're supposed to do do you boom and boom there you go and then i think i should activate soul energy max so i don't draw into obelisk because that's going to be a problem so i'll wait i'll, I'll wait until the turn is over oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no oh that's it that's, that's it that's fine okay and I'm gonna activate this now just so I don't draw into obelisk because that'll be a problem. Obelisk coming into my hand. Huh? <laughs> All right. If I draw into magical meltdown or Alistair here, we have game. We have fantastic game actually. I can overpower this field easily, but uh, it's the luck of the draw to be honest. The luck of the draw. So I really need it here. Otherwise, we're going to just draw. Upstart has to get me there. Hey, Upstart, I believe last time. Upstart got me there last time. Draw. Upstart got me there last time. And it did not get me there that time. All right, you got it, bro. GG. Yeah, that was a rough one. I ain't gonna lie. That was a rough one. That's a beautiful hand. But of course, why is it? Why is it the second I add this? Relax. Relax. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sitting. You know what, just. I just want to know why the second I added that card immediately in my hand. Like, immediately. It's actually insane. Albus, I understand. Yeah, you can literally just lick my ass. Like, literally just tongue punch my far box. Because, like, we're not doing that. Absolutely. Why are you? This is not cash tier, man. Why are you doing this now? Bro. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Anyways, magical meltdown. Go ahead and grab Alistair in my hand. I'm gonna do right, right now, right of our miss here, and then get our token out and put Fateful Adventure face up. Yes, absolutely, over here. And I will summon Alistair, which will activate this to add Draco back to my hand. I think they, I think they have impermanent hand. No, we're not gonna do that. I, th you know what? I ha hold on, wait a minute. I just realized what I can do. I can summon Obelisk here, and we're gonna do that. We're gonna do Faithful Adventure. To add um, Water Enchantress into my hand. Is this a good play? Probably not, but I'm doing it. And we'll send you to the graveyard, which will attach to the field. Yes, so this is kind of like the vision that I had initially, but again, it's just Obelisk. Like, 
Getting just obvious in the field doesn't do anything. Then we special summon Water Enchantress. Boom. Check this out. And the best part is we can summon Mecha by Long with it too. So this is literally the vision. This is the perfect case. I summon Alistair. Never mind. Duh. I forgot I did that. I literally forgot I did that. <laughs> um. So if I do this, do this, get you out. Invocation will get me where? If I summon this, it won't get the benefits of the uh, full effect. Because the thing about this card, you have to use level seven or higher when you summon it. Invocation, I don't think I, I can summon something that's a high level. Well, this is level nine. Is there a world where I do this? Is that stupid? And then summon Mecha by next turn? Yeah, I might do that, actually. Let's do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's do that. So we'll, we'll pick you. We'll banish you and you. We got Purgatrio out. It was level 7. And now we get to just link into... Wait a minute. No, no, I, I was going to say I, I have to do that. You do this, this, and that. You get... Chaos, uh, Black Lost Soldier, Soldier Chaos out on the field. And then do this to get Invocation back into my hand. And I'm going to also banish uh, Water Enchantress so I don't draw into Ride of Aramis here next round. Okay, this is basically where our where we got ourselves. This, this, is, this is where we came on, 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 on nothing. <laughs> I forgot that I, I summoned Alistair. Duh. I, I was so excited. I was like, oh, we get to get Albus out? Um, sure. What are you playing? They have 45 cards. So this Pot of Prosperity has to get them there, probably. Magic Cylinders. Battle Fader. What are you? Why are you? Why, why are we playing? Why are we playing this? Oh, no. I mean, that's fine. Because, again, this doesn't do anything. The idea is to have these... For the purpose of just um, getting bodies out. So I don't care if they blow this up. That's fine. My opponent's a moron. Never mind. Okay. So, anyways. But anywho. But anywho. But anywho. You are not real. You're not a real person. You're not a real person. Draw. Invocation is great. Um. Let's see. So I can do this. I'll bounce this one back into their, into their hand. So let's see where that gets me. Again, the beauty is they can't target Black Lost of Soldier, which is just nice. If I summon this, I can get that out. And then, can I go into Albus here in any way? No, because I would have to normal summon. And dead. Hey, it was enough to win. It was enough to win. We take these. See, I should have known the second they blast a Maxi in the draw face for some reason that that's where that duel was going to go. This... This is the, this is the third duel, by the way. Out of three duels in my hand twice since I added it. It's crazy. All right, magical meltdown first. We actually get to do this play, which I wanted to do earlier. We grab Alistair. Uh, we summon Alistair. If they have Imperm, it kind of sucks, but I'm not. Oh, okay, great. That's that's uh that's going through. Then we do this. Bam. This is why spellbook knowledge kind of works well in this deck, because remember you use invocation from the graveyard. So we're gonna go ahead and do this first to draw two. Um, not the best. Those those draws were actually awful. Never mind. That was not good. So all our turn is going to end with is just honestly. Do I just do this? No, no, no. We'll do Mechaba. We'll do Mechaba. Banish you and you. Got a bunch of bricks in my hand, unfortunately. Really bad bricks. And we'll just set Soul Energy Max for Fear, and then that's it. That's pretty much it. Um, we'll do this so we can get Alistair back into our hand. And, uh, oh, yeah, step up, call by the grave. This has to get me here. This one solid magician could have been any other important card in my deck. But I guarantee the second I remove this card, the same situation that happened the first duel will happen again. So I just got, I got to power through it. Got to power through it. Uh, absolutely not. That's, well, no, 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 no. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Because you you want to just you want to activate this to mill anyway, so they're playing Gate Guardian and they didn't mill that great. Because I assume that's what they wanted to do. They normal summon. Uh, you can add one song. That's fine. 
When a normal summon, I could banish. I don't know what this deck does. I just know that if you get the gate guardians out, which you can summon by just like, I think banishing the pieces from like the field. It's kind of hard to out with the mediocre deck, I should say. That part's important. With the mediocre deck. Like that. So you can just do this and then summon it for free. Yikes. That actually sucks. Harpy's Feather Duster. Love that. Let's, uh, that. That's fine. I mean, I guess I'm just going to activate Call by the Grave and banish this. Because that's all I can do here. Um... If I had this in attack mode, it would have been fine. Because they would have attacked. No, because then they would have just, um, they would have just summoned the, the three pieces instead. I, I think this is just GG's, to be honest. What do I have over here? Point activates a card effect that targets a card you control. You can do this. That's not, that's not resolving. That one is not resolving. Send Draco back away, and then it's going to come back to my hand, right? Is that how it works? Draco back! Back into my hand! Or does it attach to the field? Oh, it atta attaches to the field. Attached to the field. They get to do that. Yeah, it's understandable. Um, that's fine. This 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 one sucks to deal with, to be honest. I don't know how I'll stop that one. And they get to pop that. I mean, I could activate uh, Alistair. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I ha I think I have to do that, to be honest. I have to just pump myself up. You know, it'd be a great card to draw here. Uh, Breaking Ruin God. It'll be a great anime moment too, actually. That won't die, which is nice. I should have been in attack mode, to be honest, though. And I'm gonna activate this so I can draw into Obelisk. And hopefully not draw into the second Obelisk. Or I am out of here. <laughs> I'm still. I'm just still staring at this level eight in my hand. <gasps> Little. All right, so if I survive this turn and draw into Break and Ruin God, I'm fine, right? I'm not fine. <laughs> I'm not fine. <laughs> I'm not fine. <sighs> Bro. You know, the worst part is I drew into that card because I didn't want to draw it, which shuffled the deck, which means that Obelisk shuffled on top of my deck after I did that. And had I not done that, there's a good chance where I probably wouldn't have done that. Yeah. Breaking Ruin God, question mark? No. No, we get Ash Blossom. No way. <laughs> Boy, ain't no way. Boy, ain't no way. All right, so let's try this again. You know what? The second I saw level eight in my opening hand, I should just... Left. I... There's no way you can't tell me there's not an algorithm when you have one of cards in your deck and Master Duel putting in your opening hand. I, I refuse to believe it. All right. Surely we're not going to do it again, right? Yo, Maxi has to get me there, man. <laughs> Maxi has to get me there. Oh my God, bro. Yo, get off the field, bro. What you doing? Oh, they break two. Great. I was hoping they would do anything so I can play my maxi and now instead of playing 2005 Yu-Gi-Oh. Awesome. Okay. Well, uh, Alistair, Magical Meltdown, anything, and I can do a lot. It's not bad. I can bounce her field, which is nice. Okay. We can do that. I'll play right of Aramis here. And we're going to get our token out. Let's, let's go into attack mode. Because I'm going to attack with it. Activate this. Boom. And I will... I mean, I might as well summon Nemesis Corridor, right? Yeah, summon Nemesis Corridor. Activate Fateful Adventure. This is not going anywhere, unfortunately. What are you going to stop? Are you going to stop this? I'm going to say, wait a minute. Grab Draco back. Don't equip it. And then we're going to go ahead and send this away. To grab Water Enchantress. We're just trying to basically dwindle our... our, our, our... I have a play. I have a good play I can do. I'm not attacking. I'm just going to send this back to my hand. Uh, we'll send you to the graveyard, right? Yeah, because you want this in the graveyard. Send it to the graveyard. Summon Water Enchantress. Activate this. Yo, 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 yo. We get to do the cool thing? Do we get to do the cool thing? 
go ahead and bounce the monster. Yo, do we get do we do we get the cool play here? What is this? It, it comes down to whatever that card is. We summon Water Enchantress in attack mode. We get the cool animation. I love the design of this card. If that's called by the grave, I'm going to probably scream though. <laughs> okay, and just go into battle now. We go into battle. Battle phase. So we attack with this. 2000. Does that go through? Does that go through? Magic cylinder? Ah, uh, that's fine. They're going to regret that. They're going to regret that, actually. They're going to regret that. Attack! Nemesis corridor! Attack! Water enchantress! And now! I activate Soul Energy Max! And I will uh, tribute. Um, I will add all this to my hand. And I will tribute. Tribute summon Obelisk for you, you, you. Rise, my Egyptian God card! And now I will put. Wait, that's not game yet. I just realized that they don't have, uh... <laughs> Yo, that's so funny. That's actually hilarious. I, I, I'm i just going to set this and that. And I'm going to go ahead and activate this to get right in my hand. What, what, when did I, where did I do the math wrong? Oh, I should attack with, uh... Oh, no, no, I didn't have the math regardless. Bro, math is hard, man. All right, now I pass. <laughs> Yo, I can't believe that that just even happened. That's so funny. Okay. Well, good news is they can't target Obelisk, which is one of the awesome things about this card. Um, I'm sure music played or claw music played or something when I realized that I didn't have math. But it was a cool play, bro. It was a cool play. Activate this. There you go. So if they special summon, I'm gonna actually call by the grave this. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a no for me, dog. You just have to hold this obelisk punch. You're gonna have to hold hold this obelisk punch. That stopped, and now they're gone. But you, you the animation, man. I'm just, just the animation, man. Hey, I'm satisfied. Ha yeah, have a good day, indeed, bro. That's so funny because that was literally a prime me thing to do. Why do math when you can just play the game? You know. Ooh, this is a great, great. No, it's not. 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 If I summon this, then I can't do this. I think I just have to go into this. I'm gonna go ahead and summon this. Activates so a right is going to be dead here, which is fine. Okay, let that go through. What do they have? I wonder if they have Max C. They didn't. They didn't ash this. If you're gonna ash anything in the Alistair engine, it's probably gonna be Alistair. But that's also assuming that I, you know, don't have Invocation in my hand already. So we're gonna go ahead and do this. If they blast Max C now, it was Max C. Because a lot of time they'll wait for you to play a card first, and they forget that this is usually a thing that you do before you go into your combo. All right, Invocation. We're gonna get Mechaba out. Yeah, it's it's Maxi. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I actually messed up the combo. I should have gone into um Sal Magician first. I was kind of like too focused on on uh, on what you're supposed to do here. Or what they were going to play that I wasn't thinking. What'd you do this? And honestly, I'ma just hold uh I'ma just hold all, all this in my hand for, for next turn. Yeah, this should be fine. Yeah, what I was supposed to do is I was supposed to tribute um uh what's the face? Artemis. And then I would have had and then I, I would have still had two monsters on the field. And yeah, but I've done that before. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Now we have our spell negate. We have forbidden droplet. We also have max C. So the second they, they play anything, I'm playing max C. By the way, next turn I can do it. Because I have another Artemis in his deck. The question is, can he power through a single Mechaba? Okay. Oh, Sue Ships. I'm going to go ahead and activate this now. And if they try to ash it, it doesn't matter. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Ooh. Oh, they got Revised Sky God in this deck? Yo, we're playing Gods? 
Stewship is one of the few uh, weird. I say weird. I, when I say weird, I mean like in a bad way. It's one of these like more unique uh, archetypes in the game, themes, whatever you want to call them. And I will never play it. <laughs> I will never play it. Change of heart. Yeah, my guy, that's not happening. That is not happening. We're, we're dropping a right for that one. Absolutely not. Change of heart. Are they trying to make Slifer here? You know, it's funny. If they summon Slifer, it loses to Fruit for Droplet. Kurikara? You are not a real human right now. You're not real. Oh, and they get to... I, I have to Forbidden Drop with this. I absolutely have to Forbidden Drop with this. So I hang on to Sound Magician still. Because what I can do is I can crash into their monster next turn. And bring out the level 8. So level 8 can finally do something. Unless, of course, I strategically draw her right now. After this turn. Alright, so they're going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and play Forbidden Dropper right now. And I'm just going to drop... I have to drop Ash, Ash Blossom here. Confirm just that. Because I do not... Because what would happen is, is they would summon my... Uh, they would get my Mecha Bot next turn. Which I do... We're not doing that one. Absolutely not. Meanwhile, I get to recycle my entire, like, Alistair play here uh, on my next turn. Granted, that's, of course, if they don't, if they don't have, like, Ash Boss. I should have added a second Mecha Bot in this deck. Because I have room. Okay. Beautiful. And then this is not going to activate. Watch them still activate it. No! No, 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 no! Absolutely not. It's not happening. That is not happening. I draw! I, I mean, that was a good trade, I, I, I guess. I will summon Alistair. If they stop this, it's not the worst, but it will be kind of annoying. Now we go into... Now we get to do a play that I wanted to do originally. We're going to go ahead and do this, like that. Boom. Now we summon Solemn Magician off of that. Give me that. This is what I was supposed to do. And then we do Invocation. Now we get to bring out... I think I have to bring out Agodis. Yeah, Agodis has to come out here. We'll banish you and you. Boom. And I think... Um, I'll pop this. You know what? I'll bring out level 8 when this one gets destroyed. How about that? How about that? We'll put Alistair back into our hand. And simply just attack. Honestly, between Ash Blossom... And the spell negate, I should be fine here. Attack this. And then attack for a simple 2,000. There you go. Sound Magician with, with Maxi, by the way. Beautiful card. All right, main phase two. And I think that's all we can do, right? Yeah. It'll just pass. All right. Ya move! Uh, do I? Oh, we can just ash this. Yeah, we'll, we'll just ash this one. We can just ash that one. That's fine. I will save my spell negate for when something important is played. Watch them play like another change of heart or something. I bet you painful decision was the bait. Also, shout out to draw uh, Ash Blossom back to back there because my turn might have ended in that, in that situation. All right, what will you do? Fan of sushi? Nothing. I think that's, that's game, right? Uh, Draw. Maxi. Yeah, that's definitely game. 4,000. I'm just going to attack. Attack! With uh, a Godis. Activate this to make him up to 3,000. Boom! And we're going to finish the duel with, with Bay. Sour Magician attack! You know what's funny? I almost activated Maxi out of spite, but that would have lowered my attack and I would have lost for that. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm done here. I've had my fun. Uh, let me know your thoughts on the newest events, and I guess stay tuned for more Master Duel content. And now I'm just going to... Oh, I'm fading away! What's that? There's two videos on the screen you can click? Left or right? Hey, if you're still here, click the video on the left. Let's see how many people we can click. Get to click the video on the left.